Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the count if, sum if, and average if functions in Google Sheets. So this can be incredibly useful. So it takes a lot of work out of the counting, summing, and averaging process for you. If there is some special criteria that you want to condition the three functions on. Okay? So what do I mean by that? So I've set up this little data set here which should serve as a good example so I have an amount column which are a bunch of numbers and I have a type column which are a bunch of levels of category uh, so here you see for example this 33 belongs to a type red so what if I want to sum up only the red types well this can become quite tedious if your data set is a lot larger than this so sum if will do something like this more automatically for us. It'll sum up all these green uh, amounts that I've circled. Okay. Same thing with averaging and same thing for counting. So let's start over here and actually see how quickly we can arrive at these numbers. And it would be the same amount of work whether our data set was 13 or 14 kind of rows long or a million rows long. Okay, so for count, I only want to count the blue. So I could do count if I highlight the range, I hit the F4 key that locks the range that I just selected. Put it by putting dollar signs, comma. I can either in quotes type the criteria that I'm interested in and I would get 5 or since I've already written it here I can reference this cell for the second argument so I'm gonna go back in here instead of typing blue I'm gonna click on this cell that has blue in it and you see I also get 5 now the great thing is I could just drag this formula down and it's gonna count how many green and how many red and we could spot check one of these quickly see there's one two three green so this is working correctly now what if I want to sum this column based on the type of this column so if I want to sum the amounts for only type blue I can do sum if sum if I'm going to highlight the range of type hit F4 on the top of my keyboard comma the criteria again I can type in blue in quotes and that's not cap sensitive or I could just click here because I have blue written and then I highlight the sum range and I hit F4 again I make that absolute reference close the parentheses and it will sum the five blue amounts you could spot check that if you want it's 245 okay and since I put my formula in an, in an intelligent way I can just highlight this and drag this down okay so I've just quickly summed for each type the amount now let's extend that to averaging so I could do equals average if and again my first argument is the type F4 comma the criteria is blue here I'm gonna just click the type here comma the average range is the amount column for me I'm gonna hit F4 on the keyboard for that close parentheses hit enter and we get 49 and we could spot check that by doing 245 divided by 5 in fact that is 49 and we can drag this down and get the average if green and average if red let me reduce the decimal places to one okay so that's the count if sum if and average if functions almost identical to Excel so if you don't have access to Excel Google Sheets is available to you online as a service so do take advantage of that so be sure to subscribe share and comment 
Till next time, have a great day.